What is going on guys? My name is Eagle and welcome to the channel or welcome back if you are a returning subscriber. Um, and speaking of subscribers, I would like to say thank you to the 50-ish subscribers that we gained from yesterday's video. Um, so today's video is a follow-up on yesterday's video of how we lasted 8 hours with solar. Today we're going to be doing it without solar and or on a day like today where it's really cloudy and rainy but to minimize any solar input at all I'm completely going to be getting rid of the uh, solar panels I'm gonna completely unplug them so we're gonna go ahead and head on up there so actually I lied I'm gonna show you the setup again so today I had the same setup basically as yesterday to measure how many watts volts and all that that are coming into it so right now we have about 47 volts coming from the solar panels, 1.1 amps. Batteries are basically fully charged. Um, and we're just going to let it run down. I'm going to go up to the uh, solar panels. Now, see, there's no um, nothing on the PC right now. So it's completely off, and it's just drawing 1.5 volts. But we're going to go up to the top and unplug. And once we unplug, there should be 0 volts there, and then... This will be about 12 something and we'll we'll go from there. So here I am unplugging the solar panels. There are two wires here and then they go down through the roof to the charge controller and now they're unplugged so there is no voltage coming through them. Alright so now I'm back in and now it reads 13.1 so it's completely charged as you can see and then it's uh only bringing in 1.1 volts, which is basically nothing. That's just like the, like, uh, I can't think of what that's called. Like the nominal thing, whatever. It's basically nothing. It's not even bringing anything in. You can see, like, there's like a little moon there. So we're going to go ahead and start the um, computer, and we'll, we'll go from there. All right, so the PC just started, and then we just started the time lapse. And we're bringing in 171-ish volts, 130 now. So, And this is already brought down quite a bit. So it's still at a full charge battery. And I'm, I'm giving it probably about two hours. Maybe. I don't know. We're going to see. This is going to be a lot more strenuous on the uh, batteries, that's for sure. Because there's no power coming into them. I'm curious to see how it's going to go today. But we'll, we're going to go ahead and run up ARC here. And we're going to see how it goes. Alright guys, so it is now at 12.7, which is technically, for an AGM, fully charged. So, we're going to go ahead, it's got 360 watt, 70 watts, pulling, and it's got uh, 4K, epic, everything. So this is going to be the most strenuous test it can possibly be. So we're going to go ahead and go, and I have infinite stats on, that way I don't die. So, we're getting like... 55 frames somehow <laughs> but uh we'll see how long this will last what is going on guys we are back and we are at the four hours and seven minute mark and it is at 12.3 now so it is at 50 percent discharged however um i'm still playing the game so once i get out of the game so now I have the game off and we are now only pulling about 100 watts and it's at 12.5 volts because there is no more, well there is not as much amp draw anymore from the PC so now it's only, it's it went back up to 12.5 which when it's under load it's 12.3 so just to be safe I'd rather just cut it off at 12.5. 12.3 when it's under load but um so we did get about four hours out of it and honestly you could keep going more because the batteries are not completely discharged <clears throat> although they wouldn't be already discharged anyway because it's only at 50 percent even at 12.3 so you could keep going if you wanted to damage your batteries but i don't know why you would want to do that 
So that's going to conclude this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If it helped or you enjoyed it or gave you entertainment during this quarantine, uh, make sure you like, subscribe if you're not already, and comment any questions or anything you might have. And that's going to be all. Thank you guys.